Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Super Paper Mario. Um, okay, ah man, uh, if you didn't already notice, um, Paper Mario guy, he's having some problems with with his computer and the black. Oh wait, no, with his computer and the black screen of death. So the the chap the episodes uh, pertaining to Chapter Five are for now lost or at least not able to be accessed, so Paper Mario Guy's brother is going to be coming in early July, or in a couple weeks, and so whenever he stops by, hopefully we can get the episodes back, but no guarantee, so we'll find out. So I skipped ahead to chapter 6 for now, and started recording, because I mean, I'm, I'm tired of waiting, and, like, if I wait until chapter 5, like, the episodes for chapter 5 are possibly recovered, then, uh, I'm gonna fall behind, because I'm gonna have Vanilla 2, thank you, Vanilla 2, um, Super Mario 64, this game, and Zelda Ocarina of Time tryout, so, some pretty serious business overall. Not stuff that you want to forget about. So that'll be four project at, projects at once. So I'm gonna try and get some of this out of the way before I start Super Mario 64 and before my segment of um, 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 Ocarina of Time. Oh my god! I'm gonna have to heal. But it has been a while since I've played this, so hopefully I'll get the location of the pillar right. I believe it's... Yep. And this will make the heart pillar up here. Hopefully, yes. Yes, indeed it does. And actually, actually in this episode we will be doing a side quest. Um, we will be getting the pixel known as Piccolo and... He is available to you after you beat Chapter 5, which <laughs> we just did, so might as well get him. The side quest is a bit boring, so I'll be doing some cutting. I won't be cutting my wrists, I will be cutting to the parts where I get to the specific uh, areas that I need to get to, because there is a lot of backtracking, unfortunately. No one likes backtracking. Except for Squidward's house. At the duel of the hundred, the hero will meet with dark powers of purest chaos. If you fall to the hundred, the chaos world oh the hundred, the chaos world grows and the purity heart fades. And as that happens, the hero will fall to the world where all games are ended. Thanks, our good friend Nalrum. That's in the section of the light prognosticus that I just deciphered conveniently at the same time that you return from your quest to find a park pillar. It seems to suggest that if you fail to pass these duels, all worlds will be ruined. And apparently your lives would be lost along with the purity heart. That's pleasant. I still must send your f you forth, however. It saddens me that I can do nothing else. Read that stupid book. Because no one else knows how to read. Alright. Uh huh. You know, I'm just gonna go back to flip side. Take a little shortcut. And I think I'll deposit some items and start and heal and then start my side quest. Which is also in flip side, so or it's actually in flop side, but you know what I mean. It's not a very long journey at all since I have that uh blue pipe. So if we'll go down this elevator. I don't know how long it's gonna take. Ah, it's been too long since I've LP'd this. Or since the last episode I recorded on my own. It's been a while. Quite a few weeks. Weeks, Especially since I recorded these in advance. Well, this one I'm actually doing the same day that I'm going to post it, so... That's always nice. Okay, so... Oh, I don't want to buy anything. I obviously can't buy anything. Because I don't have any room. So what should we deposit? What should we deposit? I will deposit power steak. Something tells me I can cook a meal with it. 
Um, you can hold on to a potent drink, because in honesty, I don't need it. Um, cake mix, because I could probably cook something with it. Um, and thunder rage, rage. Uh, nothing else really. Now with my 411 coins, I think it would be a swell, swell time to use them to heal at this good place right here. I believe I've been here before. For five coins, I believe you recover all of your health, which I've brought up to 30 um, while I was doing chapter five with uh, the Koopa Ninja Bros. Pretty swell group of people. Good morning. Did you sleep well? Well, on your way then, get the heck out of my house. Goodbye. That was a nice curtsy. So, with 30 HP, we will go to Flopside. Flopside. Okay. I believe the person you're going to want to visit is Merly. Is this the second floor of Flopside? Yes, it is. So let's visit Merly. Merly. Merly! Uh, oh, I'm. S no. Oh my god. This whole backwards thing. This whole flip flappery. Oh my goodness. But this is the house we're looking for. Oh, she looks familiar. Ah! Oh, you have fine timing, my blood pleasures. Pressure's climbing. See, I was hoping maybe for you to do me a big favor. Can you, I implore? Uh, okay, why not? Ah, thank you, thank you, true. I knew I could count on you. Rhymes! Rhymes! I believe that my lovely uses the same type of ball as me. Would you go to her and ask for one of her crystal balls real fast? You know where my lovely is, right? Where well, the outskirts of Flipside are in sight. Thank you, thank you, True. So, guess what? Let's go to Flipside and visit Merlovely. Let's see what she has to say on the matter. Luckily, these two houses are close together. Hi, yay, yay, yay. I like your outfit and your 3D glasses. <laughs> I've been waiting, heroes. You want to ask me about the crystal ball? There's nothing to fear. I'm more lovely. It is my job to know the future. Merly sent you, did she not? Yes, I have readied the ball. Please take it. Or I'd like to say that, but there's something I must first ask of you. I know I do not look like it, but I am in training. I told someone about it, and they said they have had some useful equipment. But I've been so busy that I haven't had a chance to pick it up yet. The kind fellow who offered me the equipment is the Flip Wizard Bestovius. You would really help me out if you would agree to. Hack, cough! Would you agree to go to his house and pick it up? If you do that, then I will give you this crystal ball. Bestovius' house is beyond the Flipside's Tower of Red Door on Lineland Road. Thanks for your assistance. Uh, so now we have to go back to Chapter 1-1. And uh, we're going to talk to Bestovius, so I'll see you there. I'm going to cut right to it. And we are back. Um, hmm. So this is Bestovius' house, if you remember. The door is not hidden this time. It seems he does not hide his door after people leave. Ah, hero, what need have you of the blindingly brilliant Bestovius? Ah, so you have come for the training machine in place of Merlin. My lovely. Hmm, yes, of course I know of such a machine. Normally, I would never allow you to bask in the splendor of my knowledge, but... You are a hero. Now then, hero, I have a favor to ask of you. I have lent a certain, uh, something to the mayor of Guildtown. Town. Watch it! You must retrieve it for me. I have asked for it back many times. But the old washer just had a heart attack way too many times. It just, it just, his hearing isn't as good as it used to be, I mean. Simply ask him for the you-know-what. He will understand. Now, be gone. 
Okay, so more side quests. Uh, okay, so I will see you at Old Man Watchit's house.